William's view on Camilla delivers ultimatum as not step-grandmother of his three children. According to a royal insider, Prince William told his children that Camilla is not their step-grandmother. The passing of Queen Elizabeth II has shifted several royal roles, with Charles becoming king and Camilla queen consort. Writing in her new book, Camilla, From Outcast to Queen Consort, Angela Levin explains how the royal has managed her relationship with both King Charles' children and grandchildren over the years. William has made it clear that Camilla is the wife of his father, but not a step-grandmother to his children. Levin adds, nor has she tried to take over any responsibility as a step-grandmother to the children, Prince George, Prince Charlotte, and Prince Louis, especially as Catherine's parents, Carol and Michael Middleton, are so close. Shortly after William and Kate's first child, George, was born, the Duchess revealed what her own biological grandchildren call her, giving fans an insight into what her potential title could be with Prince Charles' grandchildren. While it's unclear whether the Cambridge kiddos used the same nickname for Camilla, Prince William did give fans insight as he stated regularly reminds his children the two grandmothers in their lives. This, of course, refers to Kate's mother, Carol Middleton, and his mother, the late Diana, Princess of Wales. It was claimed that William can never fully accept Camilla as the Queen Consort. The new Prince of Wales always makes sure Diana will be the only grandmother that his kids have. In many ways, he tried to bring back memories of his late mother alive for George, Charlotte, and Louis. Princess Charlotte even decorated her pink card with a colorful heart, stickers, and a sweet note saying that her father was missing his mother. Dear Granny Diana, I am thinking of you on Mother's Day. I love you very much, the young princess wrote. Papa is missing you. Lots of love, Charlotte. Prince William and Prince Harry had an incredibly tough few years when they were younger. From watching the dissolution of their parents' marriage to their father, Prince Charles, moving on with Camilla Parker Bowles so soon afterward, and finally losing their mother, Princess Diana, all in quick succession. Royal expert Katie Nichol even detailed how William and Laura Lopez, Camilla Parker Bowles and ex-husband Andrew Parker Bowles' daughter, took it particularly hard, and were frequently at each other's throats as a result. A family friend shared how William would blame Camilla for all the hurt she had caused his mother, which would send Laura into a rage. As Express reports, Laura, meanwhile, fought back, pointing out how, in her view, Prince Charles had destroyed her family. Once called a Rottweiler by the woman she replaced, Camilla, the second wife of the new British king and Charles, may never have fully won over the public, but she is now queen consort, holding a title few would have thought conceivable 25 years ago. Once dubbed Britain's most hated woman, Camilla was blamed by some for the end of Charles' first marriage to the beloved Princess Diana. As fans of the royal family know, Prince Charles' wedding to Camilla Parker Bowles was, in and of itself, a very untraditional move. However, many now have praised the Queen Consort's impact on the monarch, stating she is perfect for him. One of these supporters believes she will be crucial to the new reign. She gives Charles confidence, she lightens him up and makes him laugh, and she's interested in him. Camilla buoys him up in a way I don't think anyone else has been able to do since his grandmother. Through a rigorous workload, a savvy public relations campaign, and her clear devotion to her husband, Camilla has transformed herself into a symbol of duty and redemption. During the funeral of Queen Elizabeth II, the royal family stood together in unity. Some royal watchers believe that the funeral could be a turning point in mending the relationships between Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, and the rest of his family. However, Camilla's bond with the children of the Prince and Princess of Wales isn't what we expected it to be.